Hey guys, in today's video, we're going to be going over the new blog that just dropped. Well, we got a little sneak peek with the leaks. You guys should be receiving it sometime soon. Oh uh, yeah, let's go over it right now. Okay, so here we have the new update and let's go over what's new. All right, what's new? Wallet update. Now live with adjusted positioning, wallet functionality. Think of your wallet as your sidekick and crime. Fill it up during your heist. And when it's full, head back to the criminal base to cash in. Wallet recovery. Man, untimely end with the wallet full of cash it'll still be there when you return so that's what we're gonna go ahead and try out right now in the the testing server so we're gonna go ahead and do that real quick and let's see what happens you know we're gonna go ahead and rob something let's check out how what it looks like when you complete the heist and we'll deal with it again when we lose our wallet so let's go ahead and get started all right so we're here we're robbing the plane and this is the wallet look how fast you gain the stuff bro holy this is way faster i'm actually really loving this so this is like it's no it's not like slow as slow as before like right now i'm at like 10k oh it didn't give me that for some reason oh it's just not letting me grab oh okay plane wallet okay oh does this mean you could go ahead and rob multiple heist at once is i wonder if that's what it means because it says my wallet isn't full but the plane is completed okay so if, if i'm right about this i am gonna love this because i know a lot of people have missed stacking feature and if this is what i think it is then bro it's this is a blessing like i'm, I'm actually loving this right now so we're gonna go ahead and find out what it's like to cash in the wallet Ooh, okay yeah let's go ahead and cash in the wallet real quick all right so i'm here cash it in heist completed okay that's fire all right so now we're gonna go ahead and do it again but this time we'll lose the wallet and then come back for it like i'll just die to the lasers or something after robbing it okay so i have my 5k and i'm gonna go ahead and try to die real quick let's see what happens after i run into these lasers over here you know we're just gonna uh, 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 uh. dang i dropped my wallet all right, so we're back in here and i do see my wallet so we're gonna go ahead and grab it that's so cool and now we're gonna go ahead and try to see if we could stack the wallet if we could if we're able to stack the wallet from multiple heights this is gonna be amazing and i can't wait for you guys to see this live okay so we're dropping off the cargo let's see if it goes ahead and stacks our money let's see okay there we go and it does stack your wallet bro that is so amazing i'm so happy they brought back stacking bro can't wait for you guys to experience this fully all right so then once you're done like robbing everything completely i guess you could just go ahead to the criminal base and drop off your wallet bro and that's so cool like you're stacking now so that, that's, i'm so happy that's such a w they they went crazy with that and it even lists like which heist you did the bank and the jewelry store and the bank <laughs> that's, that's actually fire okay so next we're going to talk about the money truck heist update overview the money truck design so they changed the design from the old regular jewelry store to this whatever this is right here i wish we got a side profile but we don't but this is what we're going to work with and they changed the heist payout structure as well they reduced the rewards from shooting increased cash available for players to collect and there's new truck routes so if you guys were playing the testing in the pb it's no longer there anymore it, it only went one way i'm assuming but now it has different paths but also this is gonna this this is releasing releasing soon uh because so we, we don't have I, I mean this isn't even out yet but when this does come out it'll be it'll be very nice upcoming in a part two update introduction of heavy duty trucks and more i'm not sure what they mean by that but i mean by heavy i mean i guess i have an idea all right but heavy duty trucks like like we have heavy uh, i'm by heavy duty i'm thinking about like the monster truck but at, at the same time i'm assuming it's not that it's probably like this like the swat van right here but you know but like built or even the six by six uh the bruin it could be that as well but yeah like by heavy duty they could probably be talking about something like this because you know this is i would consider this a little heavy duty but i'm guessing the heavy duty is gonna have armor on it and a, a, a bigger health of life than these vehicles do these are clean i'm surprised nobody really uses the brune as much anymore because you know it is it is it's just a lot of people bro like you guys should be using this more often to be honest all right so now let's go ahead and talk about the what's coming all right what's brewing in the pbe 
jump into our public beta environment to play around with the new movement mechanics and get a feel of the first person mode. If you if you spot any bugs or have suggestions, drop us a line on Twitter or join the chat on Discord. So make sure you guys join the Mad City Discord server to report any of the bugs. Or if you don't use Discord, you could go ahead and use Twitter and tweet at them. Okay. And yeah, right now, like I said, these aren't currently out, but these are coming soon because you know this is a leak blog like they, they like they blessed us up with this so thank you eli for coming in clutch we love you all right so now season three ready to roll we're finally getting a new season guys the build for season three is complete while we're holding on to some surprises here's a tiny glimpse okay so this looks like where the sign all right all right so this is where the sign is in game you can see the mats all right so we're gonna compare them we're gonna compare them. has the raptor always been able to go invisible <laughs> like this is pretty fire <laughs> okay so from where i'm looking this looks like with the season three it, this is where like they did a whole bunch of changes from the little teaser they gave so we're gonna go ahead and look back at the teaser okay yeah this gotta be the same place you guys can see right there like the mad city sign like it oh i zoomed in okay so it looks pretty clean mad it says mad ink i'm i wonder if it's mad ink yeah i think it's a tattoo shop i don't know like I thought it'd be another car dealership, but that looks far from it, I guess. And that says Bandit something on the side over there. And the Mad City sign is now neon. It's like we're going futuristic. Like everything around here has neon signs, which is pretty cool because everything was looking stale. Like, let's go ahead and compare it back to the current state. Like, I know y'all see this, man. Like, like even like even the boat agreed. The boat just gave me a sound effect. Like, this looks goofy. Like. I mean, it doesn't look goofy, but it like it doesn't look as good as it does in that season three teaser right there. So I'm not gonna lie, they ate with that. Like this got changed, that got changed, the gun shop. Like I think it's in the, I think in the teaser it's a it looks like a grenade, and it has like a neon ring around it, and then the gas station. Let's go check. Okay, so this is where it looks like it's at, like where it's sitting, and you guys can see the difference right there. Like this is changed, this is this got remodeled the gas station has a a nicer sign like it's just a full-on neon sign all right yeah so we zoomed into the we zoomed in about all right so yeah this says bandit something mad ink this looks like the gun shop they changed it up like it's not a grenade it looks like it just got changed it looks pretty sick though and i wonder if they changed the dealership back there i'm not sure i can't really tell but from this leak this nice teaser is pretty pretty beautiful if i say so myself it gives us an idea that next season is not going to be like dull it gives us more lighting and more excitement and maybe it's like possibly future team i don't i don't know or it's maybe like cyberpunkish era i i'm not sure like we i mean it looks pretty sick in general and i honestly can't wait for you guys to experience that and i can't wait to experience it myself all right to end it let's go ahead and talk about the new vehicle all right new vehicle alert gear up vehicle enthusiasts a new addition is coming to our vehicle fleet next week here's a hint it's perfect for those who love both land and water okay 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 hold on hold on hold on hold on so we already have the thunderbird right but have y'all ever heard of the stromberg from gta uh, i gotta pull that up all right so this is the stromberg from gta but it can also go underwater like this so i i'm wondering like can it can it do both is do you guys think they'll do something like this like like do you guys think there really is a point like this would be like the first submarine vehicle in the game if they do do something like this because we already have the thunderbird it'd be really cool if they had something like this all right guys well tell me your thoughts on today's video and i'll catch you on the next one frostbites make sure you guys hit the subscribe and like one like button <laughs> later